Hi, I'm Gary Amoroso, Executive Director of the Minnesota Association of School Administrators. Welcome to another edition of Take 5. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, winter is here. It's hard to believe that we've already had our first major snowstorm of the year. I couldn't believe it as I was watching the, the TV over the weekend and they kept talking about the storm is building, the storm is building. I was like, it's going to miss us, it can't happen. And here we go, we woke up on Monday and a good portion of the state uh, was covered in snow. Some of you saw an excess of a foot of snow and it truly is not even the middle of November. I'm sure all of you had your plans in place and things went as smoothly as can be expected. I know from my own personal experience as a superintendent, regardless of what you do, what decisions you make, you'll always have some people criticizing you. So all I can uh, recommend is that you use your best judgment and always do what you believe is in the best interest of the children in your district. Remember, you're making the decisions, you take into account what's best for the kids, and regardless of the decision, you're going to have pros and you're going to have cons. That's just the reality. So thanks for everything you do on a daily basis, and I'm sure glad I don't have to worry about those snow days anymore. I want to give you an update on our committee structure. We had our nominated committee set to meet on Monday. As a result of the snowstorm, we did cancel our nominating committee meeting. Uh, nominating committee members, you should have received an email from Amy this week indicating that the committee meeting has been rescheduled for Monday, December 1st from 11 until 1.30 at MASA. And uh, please respond to Amy if you can attend and we hope to see you there. The Federal Advocacy Committee meeting was held on Tuesday. Uh, we had a little bit smaller group than we had hoped, but again, the weather played a factor. Noel Ellerson, the uh, chief lobbyist for AASA, gave us a great overview of what was happening in Washington as a result of the election and what she predicted would be happening in the upcoming uh, Congress. Uh, we're very pleased to continue our close relationship with AASA and know that as the need arises, Noel will be reaching out to us as members of AASA to provide input, to provide testimony, to provide information to our colleagues in Washington. The Legislative Committee will meet next week, Thursday, November 20th, from 10 o'clock until 3 o'clock at TIES. This is the meeting where we will begin to craft our platform to make recommendations to our board for adoption of a platform. I'm very excited about this meeting. We always have a great conversation. And I know that once the meeting is concluded, once the board approves our platform in December, we will have a platform that will truly work on behalf of the children of Minnesota. Our Executive Development Committee meeting will be held on Friday, November 21st. Uh, you were sent a reminder about that uh, this week to keep that on your calendar. The meeting will be held from 10 o'clock until 2 o'clock at MASA. The specific agenda will be forthcoming. We're at the point in the year where we're going to begin to work on our legislative contact plan for the 2015 legislative session. Region leaders, you're going to be receiving information from me next week asking you to identify three different dates that would work for your region to actually come to St. Paul and meet with the various members of your legislative delegation. We're working with uh, Valerie Dosland, our lobbyist, to look at what blocks of time might work best for uh, you to come to the uh, glorious uh, city of St. Paul. And we'll be getting that information out to you next week. As I mentioned, we'll ask you to turn back three dates. We'll then look at all of the various regions and try to compile a list and a schedule that will allow us to have a presence throughout the legislative session. Again, thanks in advance for those of you that are going to be able to come down and lobby and for those that will respond to our action alerts and send emails and make contacts with your legislators. Lastly, the AASA National Conference will be held in San Diego on February 26th to the 28th. If you're interested in attending, please go to the AASA website, register for the conference. Uh, we will have a breakfast uh, for uh, Minnesota members. Uh, we will honor our Superintendent of the Year, Sandy Lewandowski. It'll be a great time, so I hope to see you in San Diego. With that, thank you for everything you do on a daily basis for the children of Minnesota. If I can ever be of service to you, please feel free to contact me at 651-319-1211. Thank you.